voice of our great friend Tony, uh, Representative Tony LaVosta from St. Charles. So one of the interesting things is that Tony has pledged to file a house resolution, a house joint resolution, in the case that the legal Missouri campaign is successful and changes the Constitution. Because we, we still have potentially some things we can do. The legislature can put a constitutional change on the ballot through the joint resolution process. But on another level, Representative Boston is a great champion for liberty, he's a great champion for freedom, and it's a pleasure to watch him work in this building. So, Joe, you know what? Absolutely. Thank you. Well, for starters, I have pledged to file the joint resolution to fix the massive legal Missouri 2022, but only if we fail, right? We're not going to fail. Let's not start with that attitude because we still have time. There is still a possibility of getting this done, but it will be an uphill battle. The reality is, this is still a big move for this chamber. We're going to need some coaxing, we're going to need some phone calls, and we're going to need people like you showing up to make sure that people know that this is important. Because we absolutely have to stop this ballot measure in November. And the way we do that is by supporting Ron Hicks' bill. Absolutely. That's, that's the way to go. And I get a lot of flack for being a Republican supporting legalization. But the reality is, and I want you all to remember this for when you call your Republican reps, because we have a super majority here, it's in the party platform to support limited governments. Yeah. We're supposed to be out here fighting to make government smaller, not larger. And I gotta tell you, spending hundreds of millions of dollars to throw people in a cage for having the wrong plan is not small government. It is not small government to create layers upon layers upon layers of bureaucracy to allow someone to engage in normal commerce. It's not small government to add to the Constitution a measure that can be addressed in statute. And so when Representative Ron Hicks and the many co-sponsors he's got, many of which are Republicans, fight to do this the right way, and we're told, oh, well, you're not a real Republican if you support that. Why well, don't point to everyone, to Ronald Reagan, to the party platform, to Donald Trump. The purposes of government is to protect your liberty. It's not to get between you and your doctor, right? We've had that debate before. Where are all the folks that were railing against uh, Obamacare, death panels, and all that? Now they want to get between you and your doctor, who maybe says, you know what, maybe this will help you? Small government is about staying out of your way. And today, all we're asking the members of the General Assembly to do is move a common sense measure along that helps government stay out of your way. That should be a very, very easy sell for everyone in this place.